I recently went to one of the most popular donkey restaurants in Beijing. Oh, Taika Isla. There were quite a lot of people and a cute mascot to make you forget you're eating quite a cute animal. His name is Lu, or LV, or as I like to call him, Louis Vuitton. There were 24 tables ahead of me, so when I finally got in, obviously, the place was full. So, let's order. Start off with braised tofu and donkey meat soup with old Beijing sauce. And then, old Beijing sauce, donkey meat mushroom, four shower buns. Donkey meat kebabs, three please. Hang silk sun, what? Roasted pear with old Beijing tangerine peel. Mm. Here it comes. Oh, there it goes. Not mine. No. Uh, here's mine. Pop that tofu down. Piping hot. Ooh, still not sure what this is. Here comes the pear. Open that up. Mmm, smells so fragrant. Look at that pear. Here comes the donkey meat. Water our buns. Let's take a look at what's inside. Oh, yes. And finally, the donkey meat kebabs. Are you ready for this? Are you ready? Here we go. Smoke it. Okay, let's start off with the donkey meat horseshoe bun. It is delicious. Oh, so much flavour. Next up, the donkey kebabs. So they taste okay, but the cumin is so strong it overpowers the meat. I don't think you should add so much cumin to kebabs. Need to add enough? Let's try the tofu. Lovely. Bit more, bit more, bit more, bit more, bit more. Now to eat it. Whoa, tuna. Oh, the donkey soup flavour is incredible. And now the mysterious Hang Silk Sun, which turns out to be long strips of potato. Really long strips. Damn the hatch. It feels like I'm eating a never-ending bowl of noodles. But it's not. It's potato, and potato is great. Now for the pear. Fragrant, warming, sweet as sweet as me. Yes, that was gross, sorry. Anyway, verdict, kebabs were okay, but the star of the show was the donkey meat buns. Delish.